It's almost Christmas and I am multitasking, but I have to tell you that controversy has been struck. Carnival Cruise Line, they may be the Grinch of Christmas. I'm gonna get you all the details coming up. Welcome to the Travel Scouts. My name is Jason and we are your cruise information channel. So subscribe if you love cruising. Okay, so Carnival Cruise Line, they may be the Grinch of Christmas. I'm gonna get you all the details on that and in the end, you all get to decide whether or not that's the case. I just wanna say up front that in support of Carnival, that Carnival does go to some length to try to make their Christmas cruises special. For example, they get their cruise ships all decked out. They have the garland, they have the bows, they have the lights. It gets you in the Christmas mood. They also have a Christmas tree lighting special ceremony on embarkation night of every holiday cruise and that Christmas tree it remains in a central part of the ship a great place to get pictures with your friends or family and I hope that you get some great pictures with your friends and family over the next few days they have Christmas carols that you can even join in with at various times throughout the cruise they even have an ugly sweater contest so if you are selling with Carnival Cruise Line here for the holidays, make sure you pack that with you. For the playlist productions that they do in the theater, they do a Christmas show. It's sort of a fireside kind of setting. They do some Christmas songs mixed in there as well. It's great. They also have holiday trivia, Christmas bingo, Christmas movies, and they also have religious services that are offered on every cruise. But everyone is not happy, and this is where the controversy comes in. John Hill, the brand ambassador for Carnival Cruise Line, an amazing guy, he had a commenter that said this. They said, on your new ship, the Mardi Gras now, John Hill. Very disappointed, and I am not the only one, John, because everyone is saying the same thing. Why does Carnival not serve eggnog anywhere on ship during holidays? It is an American favorite. Everywhere sells eggnog flavored drinks and coffees over the holidays. Eggnog, according to this person, Everyone is saying the same thing, that Carnival Cruise Line, you need to have eggnog on your ship. But John Hill, he, he replied and said this, I will have to ask and see if we have it, but um, is it really a favorite? While I ask the beverage beards, let me ask you this. Do you enjoy eggnog? A, yes, oh yes. B, no thanks. C, never had it. Please answer A, B, or C, cheers. In order to determine whether or not Carnival Cruise Line is or is not the Grinch of Christmas, I'm asking you to answer that same question. Do you enjoy eggnog? A, yes, oh yes. B, no thanks. Or C, never had it. Comment below. And should Carnival Cruise Line be required to serve eggnog to satisfy our taste. And while the Grinch votes are coming in, I want to give a special shout out to Ronnie Squires Retired, Cruise Life TV, and Love to Cruise. Thank you for your support on last night's live show. And for all of you, be sure you subscribe with the notification bell turned on to stay up to date on cruise news and information. The next video will be coming out soon. So until then, keep on cruising and we'll catch you in the next video.